I didn't know if I was going to live to see today or if I was gone yesterday. It's a bus ride that passenger won't soon forget. What was supposed to be a seven hour ride from Chicago to Des Moines turned into a 10 hour ordeal. It all ended with a bus driver in handcuffs. Passengers on a Trailways bus say they feared for their lives when the driver started speeding, recklessly changing lanes and even hitting other vehicles. Police say the terrifying ride could have had a tragic ending. KCCI's Marcus McIntosh takes a look at what happened. It was very scary because we did. I just come from a funeral. I didn't know if that today would be my funeral. Portia Washington says the trouble started after their meal stop, where oddly enough, the bus driver who down the road would be arrested for OWI issued this warning as they got back on the bus. The bus driver told us no intoxication, no drugs, no nothing. Washington says back on the road, it was obvious to her the driver did not follow his own warning. She says he started driving very fast and erratically from one side of the road to the other. We end up hitting a semi side swiping and he lost his right hand mirror. All the while she and other passengers pleaded with the bus driver to slow down and were frantically calling 911. I kept hollering Jesus, 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 man, please slow down. Washington says this was the bus driver's response to their pleas to slow down. Y'all shut up back there. You shut up back there. I know what I'm doing. It's windy out here. Washington says it was not windy. She can't say how grateful she was to see the flashing lights of the Iowa State Patrol, whom she believes saved their lives. Sergeant Alex Dinkel agrees this situation could have ended much differently. We're very thankful we were able to get this bus stop. From the time of the 911 call to the time the troopers were able to intercept that um, was just about seven or eight minutes. And thankfully, we were able to get that bus stop safely. In Des Moines, Marcus McIntosh, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.